I'm in other news leading the way right now with this story out of Roselawn where two teenagers have been hurt in a shooting. This all happened just a short time ago along Redding and East Seymour. WLWT News 5's Rachel Hersheimer is live for us in Roselawn tonight with more on what we know. Hi, Rachel. Well, Mike and Sheree, we just learned two Woodward High School students. They're both in stable condition after being shot right near the school on Redding and Seymour just before four o'clock. CPD tells us the victims are 16 year olds and 17 year old, both males. They were transported to Children's Hospital to be treated for their injuries, but they are in stable condition. Right now, officers are looking for a suspect who investigators believe is driving a maroon colored older vehicle. Detectives are speaking with witnesses and sifting through different camera angles in the area to see what exactly unfolded this afternoon. Just a short time ago, we caught up with Lieutenant Cunningham, who says this is yet another reminder. If you see something, say something. As we go into summer months, that shootings, particularly around schools, you know, will not be accepted. And we all have a part in this. You know, we can stop some of this violence by if we see someone carrying a firearm um, that doesn't have the privileges to have a firearm, it's best just to report that prior to a shooting incident happening. This is just another reminder by Lieutenant Cunningham again. If you see something, say something. This investigation is still ongoing. If you have any information on the suspect or the car they may be driving, you're asked to contact CPD. We're live tonight in Roselawn. Rachel Hersheimer, WLWT News 5.